Hi, I'm King Art 70. Today's topic is answering a listener question from South Carolina at the name of Diane. Um, Diane want to know in Matthew uh, chapter 12, she said, I read a note from her. She said, Dear King Art, I listen to all your Bible uh, podcasts that you ever post on your channel and also on speaker.com. I would like to know, can you please tell me what do Jesus mean when he says in Matthew 12, 32 about whosoever speak a word against the Son of Man will be forgiven him, but whosoever speak a word against the Holy Ghost will not be forgiven him in this world and the one to come. Well, Diane, thank you for the question. I really appreciate it. What Jesus was saying in that verse in Matthew chapter 12, what do Matthew mean in the first place? It means Levi, okay? So what Jesus was saying in Matthew 12, 32, Jesus said, you can speak a word and speak badly of me all you want. The Son of Man will be himself in the flesh. And the Holy Ghost, Christ speaks of the Comforter. Remember the Lord Jesus said in John, the Gospel of John, chapter 14, verse 26. He said, and the Comforter, which the Father will send in my name, he will guide you and bring everything to your remembrance. So the Holy Ghost is Jesus. He's talking about the Godhead, God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. Okay, God the Father and God the Son are titles. All right. So a lot of people don't teach people about the, the three offices and those names are title. And I did a, a podcast of that. I haven't uploaded yet, but I'll upload it and make sure you, you, you listen to it when I upload it. So what Jesus was saying is if you speak against me, it could be forgiven. But if you blossom against the Holy Spirit, what that word blossom mean? It means to speak evil. of. OK, Jesus actually referring to this, the third earth age. Remember, I said in my my podcast, I uploaded like a week ago about the three earth ages. And I, and I talked about it for about 10 minutes and 57 seconds. Check it out. It's on YouTube and also on my speaker, uh, King uh, Podcast. Check it out. Jesus was speaking about that third of age. That word world in Matthew chapter 12, verses 32, is the same Greek word that Peter used in 2 Peter chapter 3, verse 7. What did he say in 2 Peter chapter 3, verse 7? But the heaven and earth, which are now kept by the same word, reserved unto fire against the day of judgment and perdition of ungodly man. Then Peter also said in the 13th verse of that second letter to the people, nevertheless, nevertheless, me, it doesn't stop what I'm saying to you. It remains the same. So let's go. Nevertheless, according to his promise, we look for a new heaven, and a new earth. That's the third of age. All right. And the heaven age Christ speaks of. First, Peter talks about the first heaven age and the earth age ever existed in his uh, second letter, chapter 3, verse 5. He said, for this they willingly are ignorant of, I'm quoting 2 Peter, chapter 3, verse 5, that by the word of God, the heavens were of old. What Peter was saying is that was in heaven age before this one. All right. So in Genesis chapter 1, verse 1, God created the heaven and earth, period. It didn't say when. Then verse 2, God wiped it out. All right. God wiped out the heaven age and then in verse 4 and 8 and God called the firmament heaven. Why? Because God had wiped out the first firmament. What is a firmament? A firmament is uh, invisible expansion that stretch above the sky. When you get a chant, use your strong recording and break that word back to the Hebrew. That's an expansion that stretch above the sky. Anything above the earth considered in heaven age. So what God did in Genesis 1 9 and God separated the water from above the firmament from the water underneath the firmament and God called the water ocean and then God called the earth earth. Why? Because God separate water. That's water above us and that's water underneath us. Okay, Genesis chapter 1 verse 9, I just quoted. So what Jesus was saying in Matthew 12, 32 is he's, he's speaking about the third of age. That word in Matthew 12, 32, that word in the Greek is eon. It's A-I-O-N. That word means age. So what Jesus is saying is if you speak badly of the Holy Ghost, which is him, it won't be forgiven you in the second earth age, which is, which is the present one we're in now, that me and you are in now, and I'm talking to you now on this podcast, and the one to come. John talks about there's a new heaven and a new earth in the book of Revelation. Remember John says in Revelation chapter 21, verses 1, 
and I and the, and I saw a new heaven and a new earth, and the first heaven and earth passed away. John wouldn't talk about this one, even though this is even though the second earth age is gonna pass away. But John was referring back to Genesis chapter one verse two. Okay, that's why Peter picks it up in his writings. Uh, second Peter chapter three, beginning reading at verse five, six, seven, and then thirteen. And then Christ brought it up here. So now you know Christ spoke about. The third of age as well. So Christ was talking about it won't be forgiving you in this one and the one to come. So I hope that helped you, Diane. Thank you for listening. Thank you for your question. Uh, make sure you check out those podcast. I just quoted to you in those verses. And I hope you have a great day and a happy new year and a Merry Christmas and God bless you. Bye.